Good day, my friend Brian. Today it was announced that Mayor Andrew Gomez and Senator Gil Jamai are two candidates for running president. Good day, Filipinos. I am Andrew Gomez, your number one mayor. Vote for me and we will go fix the mess. Gomez, number one sa balota. Makandang umaga, kababayan. I am Gil Jaime, your savior senator. Gil on top of the hill, laban kababayan. Oh my God. Aidan, laban na kayo kong ulo. Bakit pa kasi tumakbo to si Andrew Gomez? Fix the mess, fix the mess. Siya naman yung mess. Anong mess? Katong drug scandal niya? That was fake, Kathy. What do you mean, fake? Look. It was just dug up, Aidan. He ordered the media to shut it down. What do you mean, fake? It was just... Unsa? Pag sure. Uh-oh. -uh. Sure ko. I have proof, Aidan. I saved the videos and the articles that were posted before it could even spread out. They put it all down. My god, money talaga. Ay, nako. I can do anything with money. Seryoso ka, Kathy? Oo, lagi. Isend ko pa. Here. <laughs> Holy... Nga no? Why are you so shocked? I thought you decided ka pa for your president in 2028. I'm sure you're gonna choose Hale Jaime. He's clean and no records of... Kathy, remember my stream? Well, an online friend who owns a Facebook blog sent me some of his written articles. Unsa? Sure ko, ni mo friend, ki credible and reliable na author. It's like this, mong good Kathy. While I was streaming, someone asked sa comments kinsa daw akong i-vote. Karong halalan. Tapos, moto. Gisan na ko ang iyang gisan sa ako ah. Peterson seems trustworthy. He has 100k likes on his page. Okay, so, thank you user Michael sa donation. Tanong mo is... Sino iboboto mo ngayong halalan? Well, you see, we have news here. People are just destroying Andrew Gomez. He never really did anything wrong, guys. So, here's the truth. I'm posting it on my account, so make sure to read and be informed. Oh my God! So kaibigan mo pala si Peterson! Uy just ko! na yun na Facebook page for publishing fake news! mag fact check ka naman! Ito o! Oh. Tingnan mo o! Oh. It says here, Andrew Gomez is an innocent person and has never touched a single illegal drug in his life. Andrew Gomez is raised by two devoted Catholics and has lived life alongside the path of the Lord. He would never do such a crime given the responsibility as a leader. Hindi ko kayang gawin yan, says Andrew Gomez in an interview. Ay, aba! Well, this is fake! An output of disinformation. This is manipulated content. Gi-edit ni lang face ni Andrew Gomez. Tingnan mo, oh, ang obvious. Remember, I told you I saved the articles? Well, this one is from a credible source. They saw your online friend along with Andrew Gomez sa isang bar the night before the interview and the night before the article was posted. They were also with the reporter who gave out the real news. Listen to this recording pa. Alam mo Peterson, napakagago ng mga taong yan. Nagpaparty lang naman ako sa club ng Maynila at kinunan pa ako nagdudoga. Gusto niyo po ba ang tulungan ko kayo sure. sir? Kaya nga nandito ka diba? Para gaguhin yung mga tao. Diyos ko ka, um... I messed up so bad. My 500k followers ako. Yes. 
so you have 500,000 followers like you have a literal platform already just know how to fact check sa sunod B you have to read review on the headlines then check the author consider the source are they biased? are they real? where did they get the information? is it a joke? is it satire? check po mo if bago ba or daily is it timely? the news? Think before you share, Aiden. You have to make sure that the news you read is reliable because once you spread it, there's no turning back. Good day, mga kababayan. We present to our President Andrew Gomez. Magandang umaga, mga Pilipino. Salamat sa tiwala. Sana'y maayos natin ang gulo sa Pilipinas. Hindi man ako perpekto, ngunit pangako ko na gawin ko ang aking trabaho. 